This is the first question of exercise 3.2 of chapter lines and angles of class 9. The question given here is in figure 3.28 that is this picture 3.28 find the values of x and y and then show that AB is parallel to CD. Okay. Now, let us try to find the values of x and y. See here, if we take AB and EF, the lines which intersect at O, then these two angles which are adjacent to each other makes an angle equal to 180 degrees. So, we know that if two lines intersect at a point, then at that particular point, two sides sorry two angles that is adjacent angles make 180 degrees so here ef and a, uh, ab intersecting at point o where this angle and this where these two angles are adjacent to each other makes some 180 degrees okay let us see. let us write here in terms of steps okay angle e o a plus angle a o p a o p is equal to 180 degrees okay angle e o a given here is 50 degrees angle a o p that is x is equal to 180 degrees x is equal to 180 degrees minus 50 degrees which is equal to 130 degrees therefore x is equal to 130 degrees yes now here coming to this point here ef and cd are intersecting at point p we know that if two lines intersect at a point then surely it forms opposite means that is vertically opposite angles equal so here o p d and c p f are vertically opposite surely the their angles will be equal so directly i can write that y is equal to 130 degrees what is the reason angle c p f c p f is equal to angle o p d o p d which are vertically opposite angles so these two are vertically opposite angles then surely their angles will be same and equal so here y is equal to 130 degrees see here both x and y are equal see here x and y are here interior alternate if interior alternate angles are equal then surely a b and c d are parallel so we know that if two lines are parallel and there is a transversal then surely interior alternate angles will be equal here x and y are interior alternate then surely a b and c d will be parallel cause interior alternate angles are equal so here x and y are interior alternate angles which are equal to each other therefore AB is parallel to CD Hence, prove. This is the procedure to solve the given.
Ладно.